little bit more around here, Tamar Tech's going to deal a little bit more about it. Yeah, I... It's like, oh, yeah, there's just this other clubs, the thing on the thumb. Yeah. Mm. Okay. And then... Maybe after I'm back, it's more for a couple of years. Duncan got smacked, like... I think two, three weeks in a row, or something like that. It was like super bad, and then he kind of recovered, and then immediately got smacked again. Yeah, yeah good go. Oh, it didn't get lower then. <laughs> um, Kel, you you make these gloves, right? You make these gloves, right? Like you can make. Like, you don't make. Better. It's too tough for me to buy them than for me to make. If you were to teach me, would that be an option, like to, to show me how to make them and I'll make them? Tools? No. no. no that's the tools and skills is more money than you yeah. find in the gloves. Okay. So what I am curious about is whether a 3D printer, like if you if you anneal the plastic and use like a like a carbon fiber nylon or something, if you can actually print some decent plates, like hard plates. Uh, it's be a hell Inspiring gloves have so many versions and they're so cheap, they work. Why screw it? I couldn't wear them. I couldn't wear them. Yeah, you can just go. Mm -hmm. Cause I, I think it's cool. Because I've heard, actually, I've heard of Asian students at schools, right? The dads will get them like $60,000 3D printers so that they don't have to do their own projects, printing projects. And they would like obviously make money off of that because then so it's another... You can get 3D printers for less than $200 now. Well now, yeah, they're but at the time. But if at the time. Trying, yeah. Yeah. If you're not trying for detail, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, a very low end 3D printer will do what you want. Really? That's, that's super yeah, low. It's like, crazy cheap. The price has come down so much. That's ridiculous. Because you can, yeah, I saw somebody 3D printing. Like, 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 like they're surprisingly strong from like bending them. These ones? Yeah. Or, or um, the, the ones you print. I don't know how well they would stand up to sharpen that. Right, they're full right, of seams, right, 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 right. So right. if you hit it with the steam, I don't know whether they would pull it Oh, off. yeah, yeah. Because there's an explosive element to it, kind of like a. a yeah. yeah. But on the other hand, um, like I know if, if you heat them and let them cool down over time, Mm -hmm. Like you can get much stronger prints. I don't know if anyone's ever tried it. What? Okay. So what different materials are? Because yours is rubber. I've seen it done with like a hard leather. Plastic is Kydex. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Kydex. Uh, then this is like a foam rubber, and then this there's like uh, some sort of hard plastic plates on these. And the rest. Just a little bit more. Last pass. Last pass? Yep. You're at 301. Um, it was a company making some really impressive looking articulated gloves. Well, it's like, so the other thing is, um, I did an early prototype of these years ago where I went with uh, like the scale fingers. 